Yes, Salt and Peppa once famously said, or sang, I should say, let's talk about sex. A post about the birds and bees on a popular parenting site got so heated recently it went viral. Why? It was the hot topic of this. Is it wrong or okay to have sex with your children in the same room? It came up after a concerned mom posted this issue. Quote, have been increasingly disturbed since a friend told me about a week ago that she and her husband are having sex in the room with their 10-year-old and 8-year-old asleep. My friend says it's fine. They make sure the children are asleep, but I am not certain that you can be sure or that they won't wake up and lie there wondering what is happening. Is it normal in the circumstances? And what should I say, if anything, thoughts? Thoughts, thoughts. Sometimes things do happen, but in general, it is not a good idea. First of all, your kids may wake up. They might get scared. They won't understand what's going on. You're also instilling certain behaviors and values in them, and you're normalizing behavior that could really affect how they view sex later on in their future relationship. They could think that it was violent. They could think daddy was attacking mommy. I, I can tell you this. I, I don't even point. want, I would be scarred for life if as a 10 year old I woke <laughs> up and saw that. And I would never be the same. I don't want to see that. Right, well, I, it would change your future relationship. Well, you don't have a way you value. I, I mean, you don't have a context to put it in, so it does look frightening. You could hear noises or see facial grimacing. That's just hard to, how could you understand? Well, if well, an eight year old can understand it, that. Yeah, that's just, that doesn't seem that's right. Odd. It, right. But. If you were to throw a number out, I'm going to put you on the spot a little bit. Don't, and we're not going to hold you to this number, but is it one, two? Is it, you know, it, because again, there are going to be some stages where the parent wants the kid near enough a by be, because if they're crying and they need something. We know that when young infants and toddlers experience trauma, it changes their brain and stays with them. So it just depends how they're perceiving what they might wake up and see. Okay. Well, and I guess the other thing is if you are going to do this and the kids are young enough, just be gentle, maybe, <laughs> right? Just be careful, be cautious. We all go on vacation and end no, up in one room. No, you know? no screaming, no crying. No. I think this topic's over. It's done. You still, by the way, you still never gave me an age. And, and Drew's still trying to self-justify over there. I love it. We'll be right back.